Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the NSL. We have a top 25 matchup. We have the number 20 fangs and the number one animals. As we go to the castle for what should be an exciting game. For anyone wondering how these two teams got to this point, the animals have bullied their competition so far, winning their first three games by a combined score of 29, which is based, it's two mercies and one nine run win, uh, destroying the, don't go yet, destroying the survivors, um, the cons, and it was the last one, and the flankers. The fangs started off 2 0, bruising their way through the competition. But last week, they let the vacuums come into their home and blast them 12 0. You're good now. The fangs reeling off a devastating loss. And the animals, the number one team in the league, who haven't had to break a sweat yet. Seems like a bad matchup for the fangs, but anything's possible here at the NSL. Just said just earlier, uh, I think it was two or three days ago. I don't know, three days ago, we saw the tails fall. Who were number two coming into this week? So no, no one is ever safe. And that is a quiet start for the animals. Dixie Kong, the unnecessary dive will allow Toadette to get on base. Getting a little worrisome for the animals right now. That's going to get over Dixie Kong's head and that will score Toadette for the first time all season. The animals do not have the lead. And the lead grows for the fangs. Two, three, they're off to a fast start. have number one on upset watch. It is four to nothing. Make it five to nothing. What is happening? Number one is getting bullied. A team that hasn't allowed more than six runs in any game is looking to do that in the first inning! In the first inning! In the first inning! Donkey Kong is done! He did not record a single out! Ken Monty Ball, come save the day! Desperately needed that. Well, they don't finish the job, which is worrisome. Really not, obviously you're down six nothing, but Wow, where was this Fangs team last week? If this was last week, if they did this last week, they'd probably be number one. They would be the number one team. They would be the favorite. And 
Green Noki will get through the two power hitters with no issues. There's Blue Pianta. That'll get on, okay, he'll get on base. just yet. This is a big at bat. Monty Mole got to come through. The Clutch King. He's so clutch. Oh my god. The fireball. Monty Mole's going to hit a triple. Monty Mole hits a triple. Say what you want about him. I'm his biggest hater. I'm not even going to lie. He's so clutch. His team needed a spark and there he is. Can Yoshi keep it rolling? And Yoshi Egg. It bounces in. And Bruno just stares at it. They cut the lead in half. Well done, Monty Mole. And Waluigi hustle it out and they throw it to the second base. there for a moment, but number one is not going away just yet. We might be in for a better game than originally thought. Bones has to take a bad angle because of the fireball, and now it's five to six. Charging with Bowser. I mean, that's just really dumb. Oh my god. Red Paratroopa! Red Paratroopa! That's a big dog, big dog! Let's get it! This is awesome! Get hype! The Fangs are playing with purpose! Playing with intensity, playing with drive, playing with fight. Pretty poorly. Well, DK get the DK gets there. That's gonna be a double play. Bowser Jr. took the risk, not thinking DK could get there. I didn't think he'd get there. He did. Well done. Yeah, Petey. We're gonna make it seven to six. No, just off the the star thing on the top. He will make it in the second. Here's Beyonce. That's a really good hit. Runners on the corners. Get the one at first. 
It looked like Berta was debating there that half second that she took to debate between second and home, and it ended up costing her enough. Holy shit. Holy shit. He's so clutch. He's so, this is, you know, you, you, I've actually, the, 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 the manager said, yo, this is a playoff game. And Monty Mole was like, I juiced up. And we are tied up at seven. The animals are not going anywhere just yet. Great Noki, valiant effort, but now there is trouble. This team, the Fangs, while some solid offensive players, got very little pitching help. And Tonette takes a bad angle to the ball level score two. No, Yoshi doesn't run. I thought Yoshi would run for it. Animals have the lead back though. That should be two. It is. And Waluigi will chase that one down. It's weird. There's like an imaginary wall between like 7 and 11 that teams just sometimes tap out at. You know, we're in the third inning, so I would like. Cause I like score gummy and I like seeing fireworks. Oh, I'd like to see this game break that barrier. Blue dry bones. Oh, kind of disappointing. I'm not gonna lie. I really wanted to see a big donut, but still a very solid triple. Wow, that was wild. That's a quick double play. Well done, Dixie Kong. You tie it up at eight through three. What do we have in store next? <laughs> Just like that. Ding, dong, bing, bong, Donkey Kong. Makes the lead back for his animals. Yeah. Right after that, here's Bowser. You know, you just you just allowed a home run. Why not face the best player in the league? Oh wow, and blue drive homes. Not scared of the pressure. Again, not scared. Sees his opponent and decides to fight through it. He gets through the tough part of the lineup, only surrendering one. a bazooka off the bat. That baby Mario, the ball skips over his head. That's going to be an extra base. Okay. 
Monty Mull's clutch gene knows no bound. Instead of striking out, it gives his teammate a chance. Kuba doesn't really do anything with that opportunity, but still. Yoshi does a great job. Waluigi doesn't run into a double play here. Someone should score, and he doesn't even get out. Well done. 10 to 8. The animals appear ready for the marathon. The fangs appear ready for a sprint. And one team is starting to flatline the other, showing why they are number one. Donkey Kong can easily make this a six-run game if he tries. Why is he not, why are you not, why are you not charging? Why are you not charging? And you, oh, you just stare at all three pitches? All three of them go right down the middle. I mean, Blue Bones is daring. And you don't even try. And then that happens. I mean, just an abysmal at bat for Donkey Kong. Are you kidding me? Should, it should be at least be 11 to 8. Bowser Jr. does a great job getting on base though. And Donkey Kong's cannon will hold him at first. That is a really bad mistake. I'm sure that the manager is pissed though in the clubhouse. I'm sure, I'm sure he's going off right now. And Hammerbro will send this one over the wall. No, not over. That was way lower than I thought. But it is 10-9. The, the Fangs, they were given life. Donkey Kong and Bowser decided to give them life. And now they look very hungry to capitalize. Because we are not a back of the 10. Oh my god, the bunt, it goes so poorly. Blue Bones with the terrible bunt. So many mistakes from both these teams offensively and they still have scored 10 apiece. Oh my goodness. You know, it looked like they just wanted to take a safe lead and instead they kill their inning. 10 to 10, going into the sixth. Blue Bones sits down another power hitter. The power hitters have not, you know, Donkey Kong's been good. Bowser's been okay, and Pianta's had some solid singles. But Petey and Bowser as well have just dropped the ball. And Donkey Kong recently, I mean, Blue Bones has attacked them all with no fear. It's been Monty Mole, Yoshi, and Koopa who have, you know, led the comeback. What did I tell you guys? This 8 to 11 run wall. You know, teams' offenses just die. They get, I, don't get, I don't know what it is. They get in there and they just can't function. You know, we, we saw 16 runs in the first, you know, six frames. We've seen, what, four? In the past five? I mean, just that, that crazy drop is, you know, it's insane. And again, the Fangs are putting themselves in position to score. Going for the ball, star swing. That will land in, and that will score two. It is 12 to 10 Fangs. Monty Moore, valiant effort on the mound, but he is finished. In comes Dixie Kong. Bowser Jr. star hit to advance the runners. Advance Bur scores Birdo. Well done. 13 to 10. Uh, you know, like, Donkey Kong 
throw us home there? She doesn't score, but no, I didn't. And what are you going to do? You know, that's a, that's a coaching decision. I'd say you know, always to be able to cut off man. Sometimes you don't want your, 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 your guys out there just throw dukes. Dixie Kong sits down, Wario. But not Hammer Bro, as that'll be 15 to 10. Bangs back out to a five run lead. This game has been all over the place, so I can't, you know, we can't say for certain that, like, you know, it's over, or like, that they're not gonna come back, because they came back from a bigger hole in this very game, you know. That would be silly to say, but we look really good right now. Noki does a great job getting back to the base. Well done. Might not matter too much, but you do at least get through. You know, one more batter. Noki hustles. All right, both runners in scoring position now for Toadette. And that'll drop in. And Donkey Kong this time will throw to the plate and hold everyone up. Now down six. Paratrooper looking to go yard again. Man, I could, I could fell, fell jump out of his shoes on that one. While the wiggy will end the end. Six do come home though. Another explosive inning. Last time that happened, the animals immediately followed up with a comeback. Is that the case here? Toadette has to take a bad angle to the ball. Because of the fireball. And again, the clutch guy, Monty Mole, steps up. charge swing if you're the power hitter. Why are you not? I don't know, you know, I respect the manager's, uh, the manager's choice, but you gotta wonder what the philosophy is to not charge with your charge swing. Baby, more okay. To not charge with your charge, you know, with your power hitters. I mean, what are you doing? You're really shooting yourself in the foot. Sits in jeopardy of being mercy. 
Gotta assume Waluigi's coming next, but it's Pianta. It's P okay, it's Pianta. Okay. Whatever you say. That's what you want to do. I, I told you guys, though. The 8 to 11 barrier. It exists. The 7 to 11. It's 7 to 11. Sorry. The 7 to 11 barrier exists for offenses. I don't care. As soon as the fans got out of it, they jumped out to a ton of runs. I'm telling you, as soon as the animals get out of it, if they get out of it, because there's not a lot of time left, we'll see them going to run. If this goes over, which it doesn't, and that will only lead to a single, which is so unfair, because, you know, the fangs are finding all different ways to scoot it in the box. Runners on first and second for Koopa. What's he cooking in the kitchen? Cooking, and that's going to drop in. Bowser Jr. just kind of misplayed it. Drops in. All right, let's see. You know, are we gonna see that offensive uh, explosion that I was talking about? And instead, it's a quick first out, but you know, there's still two more outs. What? What? Oh wow! It actually worked. Not well, because it's terrible, but I mean, it worked, I guess. <laughs> Gotta have, oh, Blue Bones is done, I didn't realize. Gotta have, you know, your power hitter charge swing, you know, Wario's gonna come to try to finish the day. Gotta have your power hitter charge swing, you are running out of time for singles. You're running out of time, you're just not scoring at a fast enough clip. The fireball gets in the way again! And, you know, the Fangs fielders have been told by their manager, be cautious. I'd rather let the ball drop than have it be, you know, an extra base because we're going for the ball. And, you know, it's a... It is an interesting philosophy, but I can't say I agree with it. And... Okay, what is Big Now, Now I just don't know what Big Mario is doing. Now he's just not catching the ball. I don't really... I don't really know how he missed that one. But, we got a game again. Alright, there it is. 17 to 19. Win or lose for the Fangs, which losing would be devastating. What a great bounce back game. Push number one, like even even if you lose, you know, don't don't want to start acting like they're going to lose because they're winning and there's only you know one inning left. They can still add on more short insurance. So what a what a showing. You know you, you got blasted last week. Really needed a good game. And, There is trouble. Easily can score more here. That's gonna score at least one. That's gonna score two. The animals, one of the best defenses in the league, has been put on blast by the fans. Wario will make it more. 23.
That's going to be at least 24, if not 25. Nope, he's going for it. 25! That'll end the inning. 25 runs for the Fangs. Holy crap. It's a very long road, but that's a good start. You literally have to go through Wario's entire stamina and another pitcher. And that is a really not, you, I mean, you can't, can't afford outs right now. Can't, you just can't have one. The clutch god. He's been perfect today. Monty Mole has been magnificent. Can't be staring at these pitches. That's going to land through Toadette. Will not be able to stop the one from scoring. 18, down seven now, down a touchdown for Colton, a different sport. The runners go. Bowser Jr. can't get there. No, uh, Monty Mole to the plate. No, he throws safe. A hit and run, avoiding the double play. It's desperation time for number one. And it's, there's smart, smart, because if he throws it, um, to third there, which I know he wanted to do. Why is Donkey Kong not charge swinging? What is he doing? Okay, you know what? That drops in fair! That drops in fair! Off the pole! Off the pole! I totally thought that was a waste! Off the pole, it drops in! Oh my god! Bowser just stares at the first two. And he gets the third one. 21. They're making it a game at least. Wario's done. Who's next? Ooh, they don't know. They're gonna try Hammer Bro. Try to see if he can't finish it off. That'll be it. Down goes number one. In one of the weirdest games ever, the Fangs pull off the upset in an incredible shootout. Wow. We hope you enjoyed this edition of the National Sluggers League. We did. We will see you all on the next one. Peace.